What is up, mate? It's Jimmy 418. I hope you're great. I certainly am. Welcome to the very last episode of Golden Sun. But not the last episode uh, of the entire series, because we've got the next game coming up, and that's going to be probably about twice as many episodes. So if you enjoyed this, definitely check that out. I'm not sure how I get to this. It's a shortcut. I should probably do all the battles, actually, because... I don't think there's an easy way to get to this the top of the lighthouse. Yeah, that just shoots him back. Son of a gun. Yeah, I should really do all these guys. So we already did all of the, we finished all the business in, in Venus Lighthouse, but now, ooh, who's this, here we go, 29 for Maya, did I call her as a kid, Mia, I'm not even sure. Gonna go all the way back here. Oof, a little bit of a pain in the butt because I already did all this. I guess it's the only one I need to move, hey? Didn't realize that until this time. I'm really looking forward to the next game. Really excited for it. There's a lot of good puzzles. There's a lot more to it than than this game. It, it's about twice as big. It takes twice as long to complete, or at least twice the size. It might even be like three times the size. Just the map. I'm gonna get back. Jackass. So all this to get back here. And once you finish the lighthouse, then that's then that's it. Oh, we don't wanna do that. Do this though. Ooh, no, no, we don't wanna do that. Just carry this down. Oh, come on, dude. Of course, they had more uh, synergy in that game. I'm not sure. Wait, synergy. I'm not sure exactly which ones. None come to mind. Oh, I just remembered one. Some really cool ones. Is that what this is just a that was just a chest, yeah. Open that already. Like I said, all we need to do. Is that loud enough for you guys? Turn up a bit. Okay. Remember where this is. Oh, oh, what? Oh my goodness, there's so much. Oh.
Oh, man. So I, it's, it was really easy. I could just go over there. My goodness. But of course, I have to redo everything as I left. Oh, my goodness. This is... I, why do I always move it when it's right next to me? Okay, well, let's just fight them then. Oh, he's still alive. That is a dirty dog mama. There we go. Oh my goodness, look at all the damage they took. That's impressive. So, I'm just here. I think it's the last one here. I mean, I just did this, so let's hope I remember. So Ivan's just right behind Maya then. A little bit more. He's almost 30, he's almost 30. I might actually, of course it's on the right side. Oh, I have to do all this stuff again? Are you kidding me? Oh my goodness. So I thought this was gonna be a super quick episode. But apparently not. I thought I was just gonna run to the top and then beat the bad guys and you know read a lot of dialogue. Come oh come on. Really? He survived? That's impressive. Mm -mm. Right as soon as I get down, are you serious? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Wanna go down there and do something? There's something up here. I should have carry enables. Often as I'm having to use it. Nope. There's one more of those statue puzzles to do.
This part can be a little bit. Okay, that was much better than last time. Oh, I guess mine is defending. Come on, baby. Yeah, that was Isaac? Nice, level 30. So I believe this was... Let's just start from over here. It up. I think let's just go over here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Something. Like A little bit. We've got one level 30. I might go for another two. Another one? Oh, yeah, yeah, see, that's where I'm gonna drop. A little bit top here, okay. Yes, this is the thing. Well, let's just check what we're at for status here. 3,000, 10,000, and 6,000. Um, we're 13 minutes in. Okay. Okay, we can get guys in this room. That thing 41 case. I was, doing, I was doing 400 damage to the freaking guy before. Oh, we equip a, a Lua cap. Oh crap, I have a poison person. Isaac. Nope. 
So I'm, I'm actually thinking here. So let's look at our, okay, so 569, 581. Okay, so high fives and low fours for their health. And then the three high threes, mid threes, low twos. Okay, so we're gonna try something here. Oh, yeah, they're at 600. <gasps> Way higher, yeah. See, this is the one that I would always do before. Yeah, and they're at five. Unless they're attack. Yeah, they're just like higher too. Defense is a little bit lower for Garrett. But attack is way higher. Like, we're gonna be crushing. And 600, like, what? Oh, it smells. She's still cursed though? Haunted. How do I remove a haunt? I honestly don't know how. Is she gonna take damage? She's, oh, she might break? Okay, but if I don't know any freaking... Let's just... How do I cure that freaking haunting, man? I don't think I have it. Cures poison, that's it. What? Oh my goodness, I don't know, man. I'm a little, a little concerned for her health and safety. I think I can only do that in a freaking chapel. Oh my god, they're super low, that's why. Oh my goodness. Let's um, enable these guys again. My goodness. Ooh, oh! I don't want to do that. Okay, so these guys, why don't we do some, some bigger stuff here? So we'll do some Nova, Nova, Shine Plasma. We'll do a Pound Prism to see how it goes. They're really not doing much damage. Oop. Lightning thing does a big amount of damage, like big time. Oh, he doesn't have cure though. But yeah, she's like really low, running out of one. You guys each get your own. Probably could have killed him. Yeah. There we go. Okay, now we got everyone to level 30. Haunt. What is a haunt to? You receive damage from spirits. Exercise the spirit. Yeah, that's all I can do, eh? Move out of Sancta. My goodness. Well, I have the thing for. He has the ring, right? Yeah. Okay, he's got the clerics ring. Good. Okay, well, we're gonna get into this now. Do a quick save. Oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, because she stole the lure cap on. Take that off. Take that off. Take that crap off. Okay, so I'm going to do a quick save state here. Final battle. So there's probably going to be there's going to be quite a bit of dialogue before I actually get into the battle. Here we go. Let's go stay hydrated. So right after this, this is like there's no more gameplay after this. At long last, the time has come to light Venus Lighthouse's beacon. With the second beacon lit. Only two will remain. No, Jupiter, lightning, lighting Jupiter is virtually the same as lighting Mars. That is true, Jupiter is really all that remains. That's right, your dreams are within your grasp now. Why are you still here, Felix? I thought I ordered you to head on the ship. I've already, I've already sent Jenna and the others to the dock at... Idahima. Then what if you come back? Because I have a different promise to keep. A promise, you say? Hmm? You must mean Shiba. Shiba. Yes, Shiba. Why haven't you released her yet? You promised to free her once you got into Venus Lighthouse. And that's what brought you back here? You promised not to involve anyone who wasn't related to this matter. Sheba is special. Of course. Because Sheba is a special adept. You guys learned something from the first two light aces. And what would that be? In order to enter each lighthouse, you need an adept of that clan. That's why you needed me for here. Right now, we have fire, earth, and water adepts, but no wind adept. That does seem to be the case. Do we need Sheba to get into... <clears throat> Do we need Sheba to get into the Jupiter Lyres? I'm sorry, Felix, but we cannot even enter without a wind adept. That being the case, I guess I understand why you can't set Sheba free. It seems that you too have learned something. If that is all, then you should go, Felix. No. No, I cannot leave Sheba behind. I'm taking Sheba to the ship. What are you talking about, Felix? We don't know what will happen when you light this beacon. I won't leave Sheba here to find out. We told you that we'd protect Sheba. Don't you trust us? That's not what I'm saying. It's just best to be safe. Don't tell us what's best, Felix. You're not taking Sheba. Why not? What? You don't trust me? I've been with you this whole time and you don't trust me? How can we after you just demanded we free Sheba? If we had trusted you a moment ago, Sheba would be free now. Come with me, Sheba. I shall protect you. Are you ready to do this, even though it means fighting us? I... I believe he is. He would not have defied us if he lacked the will to fight. If it means protecting Sheba from harm, then I must. You have seen what we can do. You know you can't stop us. How can you protect Sheba when you can't even protect yourself? This rebellious attitude is exactly why we've never let you fight. Haven't you been given enough reason to fear us in these travels? You know, fighter Felix, how can you have to stand against us? You've questioned us for the last time. Let us see what you can do. It looks like they're having a falling out over Sheba. There's something more to it, though. It seems the Turos and Minardi no longer trust Felix. Looks like the perfect opportunity has just fallen into our laps. Now is our only chance to prevent them from lighting the beacon. There's a moment, there's not as long to spare, let's move, let's see Come on, Isaac, what are you thinking? Don't chicken out now, if we hesitate to light the beacon. Yeah. 
You can actually cut across here. Oh, what? I thought you could. Isaac. Way to blow the cover, dude. So, so, you've come to stop us. Look what your defiance has brought us, Felix. I don't need you or anyone else to rescue me, Isaac. I was just about to settle things with Satyrus and Minati. You can watch. Oh, dude, you're going to get your... <sighs> and then we'll show you the true power of this beacon's light. Oh, yeah, if it's lit, then the... In oh, yeah. But Sheba has nothing to do with this. So shit, 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 if anything happens to Sheba, we will have failed Farron. We won't permit you to lay a hand on Sheba or Felix. Oh, ho, ho, ho. so you're worried about Sheba too. Don't worry, we won't hurt Sheba if you meet our conditions. What are you doing, Saturos? Lay this to me. Sheba, do you remember the road connected to Hesperia? The Rod of Hesperia? Oh, first of the first thing she says in this game is the Rod of Hesperia. She looks like a bird, eh? The Rod required to reach the Jupiter Lightness. <laughs> yes. Those that pursue a spare Rod, is it the one? Shiba, stay where you are. You can do it from there. <laughs> I'll sound like Saturus. Hey, man, it's Shiba. Will, Shiba? Perhaps. <laughs> perhaps, perhaps. Right. Don't yell at her. We're not yelling, we just want a straight answer. So, Shiba? Their minds are veiled. I cannot see clearly, but I think it's the one. It's a waste to, to make I try again. So, what do we do now? Do you know the terms we will require before we would agree not to hurt Shiba? I want, I want the roll that will get us into Jupiter Lyres. You're smarter than I thought, if, if you've already figured it out. If you give, if you give us the Shiba's rod, we'll, we should be able to harm the greed. He wants the Shaman's rod. If it will save Shiva, I'll give it up. What? But Emma gave that to you, Ivan. Shimon's right if it means that you should be good too. What? But I'm gonna give it to you, Evan. Don't you care what happens to Shiba? Then you will give us the rod! Well done, Sateros. We finally have the Shimon's rod. Go get it, Felix. Why me? To ensure your loyalty to us. Go on, Felix. Isaac handed over the shaman's rod. What should I do with the rod? Keep it safe. Where do you think you're going, Shiba? We gave you the rod, now release Shiba. Whatever do you mean? You said you would free Shiba if we gave you the rod. Those were your terms. We gave you the rod, so release Shiba. You seem to have misunderstood. I said we wouldn't arm Sheba, but I never said we let her go. You're altering the bargain? <laughs> we can't help it if you misinterpreted Saturos' terms. Bes besides, if we were to relay Sheba, she'd be in quite a fix. What do you mean? Sheba. Sheba can't go back to La Rivera alone. What do you mean? We're going we're going to take Sheba. Oh no. That's right. You won't be going back. This is it for you. Excuse me? Enough. You're enough. You're the ones who aren't going anywhere. Bring it on, Will. You won't live long enough to regret your stupidity. Prepare to first hand experience first hand the horror of a fire master fire death. Okay, so now we get to the big battle. Honestly? I mean um, I'm not gonna really worry about any of that stuff. So I'm not even gonna worry about this gen. I'm just gonna hammer them. Poison them. Okay, 
They're doing some pretty good damage. I wonder what level they are. I mean, they're obviously a high level. They're probably level 30 or 40, or like 35 or 40. I'll just do a wish. Yeah! Yes! That would be like 200 damage. At least. Yeah. You're freaking kidding me. At least Garrett knows revive too now. Wait, 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 listen. She can use use Hell Prism. Poison him, man. I won't do any fast forwarding through this battle, because this, this is like gonna be intense. Maybe through those infernos and crap, but. Poison him, Garrett! If you poison him, he's done. Like, seriously. Taken over a thousand damage for sure. I'm really counting on that poison, Garrett. But this really is an undefeatable strategy. I've been using this since I was a kid, okay? If I could beat this game while I'm a Kid that sucks at video games. I, I wasn't. I wasn't terrible at video games. But when I when I when I play a video game now, I'm just obviously better. So, is this strategy work for me? Oh, <laughs> he's done. Oh, and he gets scared. Okay, well that's one down. That's really. It's really not going to take much more. And revive. Supernova. Okay, that's a, that's a pretty good one. Yeah, that might took some good damage there. You poison her, Garrett. She's done. Like, I think she has a little, like, pretty close to the same health as the Turtles, but. If I do, what is it? I just actually got break, didn't I? She has, oh yeah, she has frost, that's crap. Ah, still not poisoned. Flare storm is pretty good. Just hammer her out. Two more turns, she's done, I think. Shots. Who's gonna get the finishing blow? I think Ivan will. Could be it right here. He's got four one eight. That would be so appropriate. Come on. And of course. Come on, baby. Nice! That was a lot easier than I expected, but with that Jin switch around. We did it! We beat him! Alright, Shiba, let's go. 
Felix, Felix, what are you doing? I cannot give up Sheba. What? But we just saved you. I never asked, I never asked you to help us. Felix, you're not one of them. You're free to go now. So why are you doing this? The four beacons must still be lit. You're going to light the be- You're going to light the beacons? That's redonkulous, do. I felt you'd say that, but I'm going to do it anyway. So wait, if he means to light the beacons, then he's our enemy, right? Friend or enemy, you won't be taking me. Right, so do what you will, Isaac. But if you try to stop me, I'll fight you. We do- <laughs> I hope you don't think you finished us off. You may not be finished, but you can barely stand. Right now, yes, but we'll be back on our feet as soon as we do this. Oh no, he threw the elemental star into the lighthouse to shine like my eye. How could this happen? How could this happen to me? We couldn't keep them from lighting the beacon. I, I know I missed her bar. That's not all. The energy of the beacon will restore our power. How can it restore their power? Venus is an Earth elemental, right? Have you forgotten everything we've learned? Venus is Earth. It shouldn't be a source of fire. <gasps> then why would Venus give powers to fire adepts? <gasps> oh yeah, I definitely remember this. Fire and Earth share a symbiotic relationship. This light will restore our sanity. We'll fight you as many times as it takes. We won't lose. You may have beaten the two of us, but now you but now you face the true might of the Fire Clan of the North. Fire Clan of the North. Bear witness to the true strength. Of, bear witness to the true strength of the northern weir wilds. Uh, oh, give it up. We beat you once. We'll do it again. Go, Shiba. Take Felix and go. I can go. We might not have the strength to protect Shiba after this. You must take Shiba to the ship without fail. What are you waiting for? Go, Ne. No, I cannot leave. You fight them. I cannot let you fight them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What are you saying? You don't want to lose to Isaac? I wonder. I wonder if that's true. What was that? What was? Wouldn't wouldn't you be just a little sad to see your childhood friend perish? What are you saying? I'm saying you're here to protect this brat from your past. Do you really think that I would help them? Let's just say that I wouldn't put it past you. And you, Satoros, do you agree? I wouldn't say that, but it would be best not to raise our suspicion. Now who's telling whom what's best? Oh, you yeah, like your English, mate. Fine, I'll take Sheba for you. Come on, Sheba. Wait, Felix, I won't let you go. <laughs> Felix is the least of your worries now. <laughs> the glowing it's time you learned what true power is the synergy is overflowing yeah 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. it's too late to run oh no the fusing they've merged into one another everyone get big yeah okay i forgot about this guy but as soon as the thing yeah i remember this this is a wow and that's a freaking massive beast we're gonna have to do two wish wells i believe what i do well, I'll do a wish well for him and then a wish for her. What, poison? Oh, if you poison him on the first turn, that would be big money. This is pretty good. I'm going to turn it up a little bit. Because I just want to have this, like... An evil spirit gives Maya again, like... Mia? This goes both ways. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm gonna have to do him do wish well now. 
Come on, poison him. Oh my goodness, this is a big one. This is like Meteor. Hundred and thirty-six and two twenty-two. In that outer space again, are you dude? Maya's dead then. No oh that was a lot weaker than the first time. Poison oh no, that's not gonna poison. It's like a Nice. Twenty-one. Drain thing. Thank you. And then of course she's Maya is just so susceptible to everything, eh? Oh come on! I, how can I poison the freaking Deadbeard, but not this guy? I think I don't know if Deadbeard's harder than this guy. I think he is. again. Frick. Freaking Shiza. Ooh, Dragon Driver? What the heck is this? Ooh, that's Maya's dead. Okay, it was, they're just attacking Isaac. Here we're gonna have to do a wishbow on both parties. Maya's just unreliable. Can't trust her. Oh, there you go. Yeah, that's right. Oh, but if Maya doesn't have the frickin'... Oh, thank goodness, Maya. Yeah, this is only do drown, because that's water damage, right? See, they're just trying to take down Isaac, man! That's all she has, she doesn't have anything else. Poison! Come on. Because, yeah, Deadbeard was taking 400 damage each turn. Just from the poison. And that's what really killed him so quickly. I don't know how long this is going to take. Severe blow. Ooh, 110 damage, buddy. Outer space again. I remember them using Pyroplasm. Maybe that was just Saturos in the Mercury Lighthouse? No, he didn't use it then. Poison. I think it was really might do that. Isaac is probably kill gonna kill him again. Like Isaac's definitely the beefiest cake in the bunch. Okay. Like this way, this is really a fail-proof, fail-proof setup. You get to heal every turn, and you get two guys attacking every turn. So you, it's really hard to die unless like Minardi does that thing where he just kills you in one hit. But like, that was terrible damage. How would you even think about using that? Let's just do this. I figured there was one that could bring me down to one health again. It's just Isaac, they're so beating on Isaac. 
Oh, he's only at 372. Poison him. That's it? We didn't get any XP from that, though. Ah! How did we lose? We are superior in, e in every way, but still, we were defeated. <gasps> we did it! We won! We beat them, but have we really won? Even though we couldn't stop the beacon from being lit? What are you talking about? All, all our efforts were for naught. What are you talking about? We did everything we could. Sure, we couldn't save the Venus Lighthouse, but... We beat them! They're gone! You saw them fall down into the pit. So we don't have to worry about any more beacons being lit. But Felix is gone and he's taken Sheba. What's wrong with you guys? Isaac, what are you looking at? Felix! Did you finish them? No one knew their power better than I did if you destroyed them. Then I am no match for you now, Isaac. I must go. Come, Sheba. Wait, Felix. Why did you run from us? They fell into the lawyers. It's all over. Poor fools. If you think it's over, you are sadly mistaken. If you plan to light the other beacons, you will still need... The elemental stars? We have them. They're gone, Felix. You don't have to light the beacons anymore. Yes, I do. If I don't light the beacons... What will happen? It's no use talking about it. Just wait and say. If you won't release Sheba, we'll have to take her back. That's part. That's pretty scary. Then pan over to the left. The lighthouse! Isaac, they're too far away. We can't reach Felix. That's not all. There's light coming from down below. No, Sheba! Hold on, Sheba, take my hand. I can't. You must try, if you don't, you'll fall. Look down, the foundations of the lighthouse are crumbling. Why is this happening? Is it to protect Venus Lighthouse? I'm slipping. I can't hold on any longer. No! Don't let go, you can't, you'll... Goodbye, Felix. And thank you. <gasps> Slowly sliding down. I'm like smudging down the side of the lighthouse. My goodness. Sheba! No! I won't let you die! Oh, <gasps> That's the first time Isaac's face pops up. Sheba fell after that last tremor. Felix didn't dive into the sea after her, did he? I can't believe he did that from so high up. You idiot, Felix! I can't believe he'd s he said he'd light the other beacons! He would have had to fight him if this hadn't happened. But if he sacrificed himself to save Sheba, he's not like Saturos. I'm at loss, Isaac. We have, to do, we have to decide what to do next. What to do? What can we do? What about Jenna and the others at Idahima? Oh yeah, I completely forgot about Jenna. Isaac, listen up. 
We've got to find Jenna. Jenna's your sister, dude. How did you forget about her? Look at that. Isaac finally has come back to his senses. Shouldn't we go find Jenna and the others right away? After all this, you don't think we have the guts to tell Jenna about Felix. If you don't tell her about Felix, then who will? It's about time you, it's about time you started agreeing with me. Isaac, you'll have to tell Jenna. Jenna. <laughs> Jenna about Felix. I know, I know it will be hard, but you'll be there to comfort her. What's the matter, Garrett? I was just thinking, how the heck are we supposed to get in? Good point. This is going to make leaving very difficult. <gasps> it's back to normal. That was odd. What's going on, Randy? I don't think we'll ever know. At least now we can go search for Jenna and the others. All right, let's go, Isaac. It's time to find Jenna. Oh, that's not me controlling him. You probably guessed that, though. But despite a long and tiring search, Jenna was nowhere to be found. Okay, I do remember this, yeah. How did the search for sheep? How did the search for Sheba turn out? We were unable to find any sign of her. The seas are too rough to search. And there's no sign of her on land. Toby. Toby is responsible for Sheba's fate. No apology can reflect the sorrow I feel at your loss, Farron. All we can do now for Sheba is hope. But tell me, what kind of Jenna... What of Jenna and the others? <laughs> what kind of Jenna is it? What kind of Jenna is she? The same. We've searched all over, but they're nowhere to be found. The ground tore apart from the shock of the lighthouse and the ship. Apparently, apparently everything at Idahima, including the ship, was swept away. So Idahima itself was washed out to sea? Incredible, and the cave too has been flooded. Incredible. No, it just doesn't say it's the same thing. But we think, but we think Jenna and the others are still alive. They may have been washed out to sea with Idahima. We have decided to continue searching for Jenna. Haven't we, Isaac? You need not worry about Shiba. We will find Shiba without fail. Uh, Shiba has been in dangerous situations before and lived. You went falling off a lighthouse, dude. But this time, I believe it was nothing short of a miracle. Uh, we knew the, the Sia would rise up to the lighthouse uh, just as uh, she fell. Uh. Can you really call that a miracle? Uh? Do you think it was just good luck? Let's call it me a coincidence, Vinny. Nothing is coincidental when it comes to this child. Do you believe Sheba survived? Yes, I am sure of it. Just because Sheba was an adept? An adept? What is that? Well, it's... It's someone with abilities like theirs. Isaac, you and your friends are truly amazing. We were able to enter the Venus the ancient ruins to get to Venus Lighthouse. But Sheba was different. She couldn't enter the ruins. That's just because Sheba's abilities are different from theirs. No matter how many times I explain it to Farron, he doesn't get it. Garrett, don't be rude. Are you D-E? I am. Unfortunately, we don't have time to talk. We've got to go. That's right. I didn't mean to keep you. That didn't come out right. We mean that while we're talking, Jenna and the others are lost at sea. I understand you desire to leave as soon as possible. The, the seas have been very rough since the beacon was lit. Be careful. 
You too. Farewell. Take care and farewell. Godspeed. Thank you very much. I hope your search for Shiba yields success. Okay, so I do get to do. Please wait for me outside Fair and Zell, so I should speak with you. Where are you going? I was like, isn't ready to get? You're gonna need you to work on your. <laughs> I know we need to leave, but we should hear what item has to say. We can do the oil a little bit longer. Thank you for waiting for me. And you no doubt have guessed I need to speak with you about Lemuria. Yes, the island of the ancients far out to sea. When you could not find Jenna, you returned to Venus Lighthouse. Yeah, the base of Elias is flooded, so we couldn't get it. And that's when you gazed out to sea, as you promised ba as you promised Babby you would. Yes, and we saw an area wrapped in mist. I remembered how Babby said an area was always covered in mist. I'm not sure, but I'm beginning to think that might be Lumeria. If it is, then Babby's life. Could be saved? Yes. Then I guess we have no choice but to go. You swore no if it's meaningless unless you go immediately. Probably the same thing. Good, then it's settled. I'll make arrangements for you to leave at once. But we have to go find Jenna first. This, that is the other reason I wanted to see you, to give you this. Oh, isn't that... You will, you will need it to sail Babby's ship. I thought the ship we saw at Idama was Babby's. His ship is he here in La Levero. La Levero. So the ship at the peninsula is the the ship. Perhaps, but we have no way of finding out that now. Yes, they're gone. But now we can sail the ship of the ancients. It certainly will aid us in our search for Jenna. Betty told me the ship is a uh, the the ship is of the ancients is an incredible vessel. I will make your search for Jenna easy. It will make your search for Jenna. Well, we appreciate it. Yeah. But I want you to find Lumeria as soon as possible. We promised Babby we would find Lumeria. We will not fail him. I've got the black gold. I've got the black gold. I've been. The ship is docked at the edge of town. You will know it when you see it. Farewell, and bring us news back of Liberia. Does it bring us back? And bring back thus news of Liberia. Dave's gonna say I got the black orb. Hold on, Isaac, we can finally get to the ocean. To see we go. It is time to depart. I was told to let you in if you showed up. The door's open. Yeah, I think mean, this was the last. There's really no point of having anything here, but is there anything over here? So we're not gonna do any fast forwarding. We might have to at the for the credits. Oh my goodness, what if I didn't have enough item? <gasps> would I even be able to have the item? Oh, that would be so funny. Ivan uses black orb. I kind of want to find out what happens if you go, if you don't have enough room for the item. Oh, that's a gorgeous ship, dude. That's the chime that I like. It looks like it's time to find. It looks like it's finally time to leave Gondolon. It's so strange. We've been traveling for so long, and yet it feels like we've only just begun. That's his uh, hint at a sequel. Now that I might, now that I think about it, 
so many things have happened. But our journey will be over as soon as we find Jenna, right? No. What do you say? Our next journey? What journey is it? You didn't forget, did you, Garrett? I promised to Babby. Here we go, go back. The end of one journey, but the beginning of another? No way! You didn't forget, did you, Garrett? Promise to be oh Lemuria. I wonder what kind of place Lemuria is. We have to find Jenna before we go to going to Lemuria, don't we? Yeah, that's important. Huh? Jenna's gonna be very sad when I tell her what you said. At any rate, this will be our first time on the ocean. So this is the ocean, Crichton wanted me to say. The seas are very rough, do you think we'll be okay? I guess it's hard to say. Still we must go, just the same. This is a Lemurian ship, we'll be fine. Well, shall we then? To sea. Jedi is waiting for us. I wonder who has the last dialogue. Yeah, so we'll just fast forward to this. Uh, thank you. This has been a very, very exciting... I mean, oh, and it goes all through all the backgrounds here that you face when you battle enemies. So that's pretty cool. Mercury Lighthouse. So it does show tre Treachery first. And then that's... That's the Mogul Forest. Oh, man, the cave. That's the first desert. I forget what that's called. Isn't the ship? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That was fun. Let's see. It's Colosso. That's Alt Miller Cave. That's Suhala Desert. That is... Oh, the oh, Crossbone Isles. It shows that. And then, yep. Yeah, again, Crossbone Isles there. And then this is the uh, Gondolon Passage, I believe. And then Venus Lighthouse. Or I guess it's the Ruins first. And then Venus Lighthouse. So we're getting pretty close to the end then. But I believe you, you, you really can only just reset. reset. Oh, oh, oh. Save your adventure. <gasps> you can't resume your adventure with this data. Be careful where you choose the places. I don't even have a save file yet! <laughs> oh, yep. Raiden, how long will this island continue to drift? I don't know. I wish you could tell me. Sheesh, you know help in times like this. Hey. I'm hungry. How can you think about food? I wonder what happened to my brother. I can't be certain, but it looks like they lit the Venus, bu Venus beacon. You don't have to tell me that. That's how we wound up a drifted sea, right? You are so cranky today, Jenna. Well, I suppose you must be worried about Felix. Isaac and his friends must have been must have, must have been nearby too. <laughs> they, they probably were. I miss them. Isaac, Felix, Felice. <laughs> Alex, that's for sure you, dude. There is something I wish to show you. Walk this way. Just jumps up, no problem. <sighs> Felix, Sheba! Felix, Sheba! Hey, 
They're alive! They're alive! What is this, Alex? What happened? JB continued. And that just resets. All right, everyone. Thank you very much for joining me on this Golden Sun adventure. I really, really appreciate your uh, your effort here. I forget what, I forget what battle mode is. Anyway, thank you for joining me on this Golden Sun. Uh, it's been it's been a it, it's been a lot of fun. It's been a great time. Uh, it's it, it challenging, but once you get the setup, it's you know you can you can just destroy. So I'm really excited to start the next game. That's actually I was looking forward to it since before I even started Golden Sun. I'm really excited. That was is so much more to do in there. A lot more open map, so you can go do whatever you want to do whenever you want to do it. There are some orders, of course. But I can't wait to jump into that with all of you. Thank you very much. I love each and every one of you with all of my heart. And, and I really appreciate you joining me on this adventure. It's not over yet. I will see you in the next one of the first episode of Golden Sun, The Lost Age. Thank you very much. Much love. And have... A good night.